Recording. Uh, record. Hi, where's you sitting? Right there? No, Papa. I have a I have All right. I I I I am so Okay, okay, okay. Do you, do you, chill out. Chill out. Papa's gonna help you. Okay, calm down. Papa's gonna help you. Thanks. Can you scoot over towards yes. me so we can make it, get everybody on the screen here? Yep. We're going to do zooming with Graham Marine. Little so, Triceratops can stay right there. Remember, Are you going remember, Sunday? Bud, um, we're going to make sure other sit. people get chances to talk to you. Sit. Okay. Sit. Dio, sit. Hey. Can you go, bud? Why can't we just go and chat to them? Go and chat with them? Mm -hmm. Well, no one has has logged on yet except for us. You mean, you mean go to where they are, my love? Yeah, that's your shoot. We can't go to where they are because Tim and Katie are how many miles? 100 miles away? Oh, more than that. 300 miles away? Mm. 200 miles away. Yeah, didn't we? It's like 180 or something. Love, I'm just going to pick a pizza. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 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 No problem. Hey. Thanks for making dinner, Love. Hey. Well, thanks actually, for, thank you. Thanks for putting BTUs into dinner, Love. There you go. There you go. That's <laughs> more like it. Huh. huh. So, Mama. yeah, so I think Mama. I think I'll tell Shannon that I'll take the kids all the kids Mama. on Monday. Mama. I, for, I forgot Mama. to do that. And then um, Mama. Mama be here soon. Right, Patience, please. And then. Uh, does he want uh, vino or is he going to save all by? I'll do a little wine. I'm not going to drink, but I'm, I'm not going to right. have like you a beer. But I think we're, I think we're going to meet at, at Pete's. Yeah, or, you have some room. Yeah, uh, Alimentari Rossini grocery store. Pete Coleman, sorry. Oh. Sorry, that's totally weird, weird use Pete of... Pete Coleman in your room? Uh, no, but JD is and their buddies, and so it's like... All right. This people is for people this. are worried about rain. Okay. We have a big old, big old salad to eat for two. Uh, yes. Let me get my wine and thy wine going. Mayo, Can we switch? Uh, no, that's thy water, bud. I know it's hard to take Okay, let's just take the top off right there. No, please, please don't. Saturday. Yeah, delivery is coming next Wednesday. It next looks Wednesday. like. Yeah. So might you work Sunday or no? Okay, cool. Well, then come up with us. Cool. Yeah, why not? Then we can help mom and dad with whatever they need, and we can head home and we can yeah. plan for the summer. And that'll be whatever. that'll be fun. To do. <laughs> All right, team. <laughs> They are just minutes away, maybe one, two minutes. We should probably do Grace, our little family. Grandpa. Oh my goodness, I still don't even have my own food. Because family VID not happening tomorrow. Maybe it's Hi, hi. You said I had a fork? Yeah. Ah, okay. Yay. Yeah. Oh, two forks. Yeah. Two forks. yeah. No, you know, in case. No, no, Rora, who's that? I have a fork. Who's that? Who's that Rora with a fork? All right, ready? Quick, Grace. 
Well, everybody else is still waiting for everyone. Dada, dada, dada. And here comes the spooky. We're done. Jam. Jam, jam, jam. Hey. Hi. Here we go. <coughs> Nursing always leaves us a little. Should we go for a little, a little low cut? No, no. No, Polly. No. Thanks, Rora. I think this is mom's. I think this is maybe mom's. Mm-hmm. Mama. Baba. Yeah, that one's mine. Thank you. Mm. Mm-hmm. Go on a guy's night. Guys, no. Rora. Rora. You know what that means? We're gonna do it tonight. A little bit. Have a good night. And can we do spider and waffles? What? Can we do splash and waffles? Splash some, oh, splash and bubbles. Oh, we'll see. Usually, Family Vid Night is like a documentary, but. A nature. Mm-hmm. Are you sure this is the right thing? It's five minutes after. Hey! Hey, hey! Hey! Are you talking to each other? Nonsense. Hey! Oh, hey guys. Continue. Happy Hi, birthday, Thank Grandpa you. Topher. Happy hey. birthday, Grandpa Topher. Well, Ryan. Oh, they are there. Oh, there are there. Oh, there they are. Okay. We have a little bit of an internet emergency here because our internet is out. So I'm on the oh. phone. Oh, and my goodness. The delay and stuff. Get you into a box. Uh, June. Oh, oh, come back. There we go. Oh, Paul got a haircut. Oh, Paul got a haircut. Everybody did. Where's Everybody the got a haircut. Looking good. Nice haircut. Looking good. I like Aurora's cut. Well, happy, happy birthday, Dad. Well, thanks. We're in the middle. We have uh, multiple things at this particular time of day. Uh, mostly right now it's one and that, yeah, you can't well, carefully. One kid uh, practices um, piano and then the other. And so uh, it's Liam's, it's Bede's turn right now. And uh, then it will be Liam's turn, Liam's turn. but we're, uh, and Katie's changing up, we'll be right out. And happy birthday. Yeah. So well, uh, thanks very much. Thanks for both families for uh, being there. It's oh a little goodness. weird because it's it's not sixty, it's not seventy, it's not seventy-five, it's not something vulner- venerable like eighty. It's, it's venerable. Of, it's sort of a or- is totally venerable. It's sort of an <laughs> ordinary number. No way, dude! You're half gross. Oh, half gross? He's a half gross? Bam. Bam, Paul Lily. Well, wow. Here's the, here's the one gross. half gross. Someday you'll be full gross, Dad. You'll see. You'll see. Gifted and talented. I think he already is full gross. <laughs> <laughs> but today he's also half gross. Dad, any excuse. It doesn't matter. Let's just pick some excuses to do Zoom calls. Your birthday is an excuse. Half That's gross. Right. Uh, yeah. you know, the fact that Ray Sweeney reopened couriers, yeah, that's an excuse. Sweeney. Let's talk I'll about that. Well, uh, Tim, I'm going to send thee the cute little statewide news blurb on, on the couriers guy. market. Ray Sweeney, you will recognize oh, I love to see Jessica it. Sweeney, who used to be Jessica, somebody else, and Ray Sweeney, who are now taking over couriers. I, I mean, mom and dad told me about this and i'm excited about it. okay dreams get your stuff out of the way hi guys guys. how are you good good to see you 
I want to come eat your dinner. It looks really tasty. Oh, your yes. dinner looks better than our dinner. We does. have a veritable potpourri, which means pasta. Oh gosh. Pasta, um, split pea soup. Wow. Amalgamated salad. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. With runaway broccoli. That looks amazing. And Tim, what's that jello thing he's eating? Well, we have crackers. Yep. Cheese. Mm -hmm. and fruit paste. Ew, I mean, paste. yum. New Zealand plum paste. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. really good. Mm -hmm. Neo. Yeah. Birthday yeah. toast. Wow. Well, thanks, Katie. Well, mm -hmm. I, I was just complaining about 72 not being a particularly uh, auspicious or important number. And oh, Paul, yeah. Paul Ely corrected us and said it's a half of a gross. Yeah. Oh. Which I think is genius. I don't even know what that is. A, a gross, gross is 144. 144. It's a, a dozen dozens. Oh, mm -hmm. great. Well, perfect then. No. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so, you know, Dad, I have to say, I'm, I'm impressed because I think the usual, the average 72 year old upon reaching 72, their comment on their age is not, well, this is a boring uh, numerical value. <laughs> their comment on their age has much more to do with uh, other complaints. So, so congratulations mm -hmm. and, and bravo. Bravo. <laughs> bravo. <laughs> well, thanks. Um, also, Dad. Yeah. This is kind of a big day. It might not have, Tim might, Tim's article thing with the Royal Society Journal may have come out before this, but I learned about it today. Therefore, cool. it's part of your birthday. Today awesome is the day that it happened. The world is because, learning about it today. Okay. So today is the day that it happened. I shared it with all my colleagues and one of them wrote back and said, I think he lost me at sentence two. And then she wrote back and said, <laughs> maybe sentence one. <laughs> but point being, it's, not for you, it's super a big day for Tim. And let me tell you, I just got some news today. About wait, wait, wait. Can I just jump in? Oh, yeah. Because my news is very small. Oh, no, it's not small. But it feels important. Today, I'm fully vaccinated. Hey! hey. Yeah! So now we, now we can have the, the bigger accomplishments. I also just happened to get my second shot today. Liam also hey. got fully vaccinated today. All right. Excellent. So, Grandpa Topher. Yeah. Royal Society uh, Journal publication. Liam, second shot. Paul, fully vaccinated. Sarah Waring, finding out what her timeline is for her current job before she goes to work for President Biden. Oh, oh. So keep going, talk to us. No problem. <laughs> so uh, what I found out today is that the 20, the 20 states who have nominated presidential appointees, those appointees will be shared publicly at the end of the uh, federal fiscal year, which is September 30. So essentially, I have between now and the end of September to work at my current job. October, I will start working for President Biden. Woo! <laughs> hey, Sarah. Well done, so, Dad, it's a big day. It's a big it's day. It's a really big day. Oh, wow. Topher. Wow. Here, here's for Sarah and here's for Tim. What did he say? And, he, and here's to Paul, uh, Liam. Papa's lap. Oh no! Oh <laughs> that? I'll tell you what was Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Well, congratulations, Sarah. Yay. Congratulations, Sarah. That's really exciting. Yeah. You learned about wow. the time, so. So. That means that he will appoint you or has a point or the, so it, that it means take effect that or Leahy has chosen me as the Vermont state nominee for this position. If President Biden decides for whatever reason he has a different Vermonter he would like yeah. to appoint, yeah. that is still yeah. a possibility. If something else happens between now and then, that's a possibility. But the fact that Leahy put my name on a letter that went to the president's desk is uh, that's that happened. It was definite. 
Never. But that happened a while ago. Well, what's the new thing now? The new thing is that now we know when the president might actually sign all those letters. Gotcha. Uh -huh. yeah. That's good. Okay. Which, Which is kind of cool so, because. Oh, and it's October. It, it, yeah. It, and, and it okay. sounds, you know, Tim, you'll appreciate this. I'm sure that it means all the stuff we didn't know we could do this summer or didn't know what, the, you know, who. How is how is care for Aurora going to work? You know, do I need three days a week or four days a week? Because Sarah has Fridays off in the summer at her current job, certainly not at her new job. You know, and so just like all this scheduling is now like okay, we can plan a trip. We can you know we we know what summer looks like. You know, and just and just knowing that like she can put in her three months notice or whatever at, at her current job and make a make the exit strategy. Right. Sorry, yep. take some, no. no, you're you're nailing wow. it. I just heard it's, the news secondhand, Sarah. Sorry, piano teacher transition there. That's no, it's super good. exciting. It's super exciting. I kind of am. There's part of me that is. Um, there's a there's an unreality about the idea that I would in the next twelve months meet President Biden because they oh. do they do an actual in-person meeting and yep. then also wow. get a phone call from him in which he offers me a job, right? Like there's a little bit of like, what? I don't think that's, I don't yes. think that's going to happen. That's yeah, amazing. Exactly. I mean, I'm 41, right? Like I haven't done that much stuff, huh. but, sure. but, huh. <laughs> but enough Thank people you. think that I have that, you know, here I am. I think, I think if you asked Orion, and Aurora mm -hmm. about mm -hmm. how much stuff you've done yeah, what do you or think? maybe how important you are. No. I think they might think you're important. Yeah, it's true. I think it's an important measure. They might, yeah. they might. it's true. I'll bring it right back. That's yeah. super exciting. Well, well, bravo. So this is a big, yeah. this is a big day. Liam got injected. Paul got injected. Papers were published. People have job offers. Grandpa Topher became 72 and he's oh, half yeah. a gross. Amazing. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Which means well, he's not fully, not fully gross. Yeah, just halfway here. Yeah. Just about halfway. Yeah. 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 And I just thoroughly confused our piano teacher. <laughs> I thought and Ryan would was... like to tell a story too. Go ahead. Bro. Once I clapped so hard, and when you said that thing, and you all clapped, I clapped almost so hard I clapped myself out of Papa's lap. Whoa! <laughs> I'm glad you didn't clap yourself onto the floor. <laughs> Me too. Well, so Tim, I got a question. I've read thy paper from beginning to end. Oh, that's awesome! Oh, very good. And the 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 question I have is: Did yeah. did they have to edit that for the for the Royal Society? Yeah. Uh, yes. So I did. in in the original paper, did they have more examples of a lot more? Yeah, I in, so. in fact, the paper the paper that they read in the past was uh, uh, was definitely it's it's basically an entirely different paper. We had to totally rewrite it. It's a totally new paper. We're still going to publish that other one in a, in a different journal now. Um, and so, yeah, it's a totally different paper because we uh, realized we could, if this is a review paper and then Royal Society review papers are certain things and you have to make a prop proposal. And so we made the proposal and they accepted it and, and then we could do it. And then we had to, we had to make that thing happen, which wasn't the thing we'd already done. Right. And, and we didn't have the space to include those tables of examples. Right. Okay. Uh, so instead, it's basically here's the idea. Hope you can connect the dots. Well, they, they, they had two examples. One was the glucose intolerance and and uh, dairy farming. Yeah. Lactose. Lactose. Yeah. Lactose intolerance. Right. And the other one was uh, cesarean sections. Yep. And gestational surrogacy, which is even more interesting. Uh, I missed that one. Yeah. Tim, can you, sorry, I was just curious if you could give a, you know, five five year old ab, uh, uh, slash thirty six year old abstract. Yes. Uh, 
Uh, Here it uh, is. Idea. Here's the idea, Orion. This is super cool. So um, this thing that we're talking about uh, is an idea that I came up with, which is kind of like humans are evolving to kind of become a little bit more like ants. What? What do you like think about that? Not small and hard, but okay. in that we work together really, really close like ants do with special different jobs and we have a internet. big colony. Oh, yeah, sure. And so we're, we're becoming a super organism in the same way they are. Can you imagine that? Excellent. I think so, I guess, what is the new about ant society? There are what kinds of ants? <laughs> there are what kinds of roles? It's kind of like bees. What kinds of different bees are there? Munch, munch. All right, we're working on this. Uh, uh, there's your, there's your, now, Paul, I can give you a 36 year old overview. Oh, one yeah, stage, sure. Yeah. One one stage uh, more complex. <clears throat> that's that's exactly the correct number of stages to go more complex. <laughs> <laughs> so the idea is, people have wondered if we're becoming a superorganism for a long time, mm -hmm. uh, and the people who study biology say, nope, it's not happening for a bunch of reasons that are biology reasons. People who study culture are like, yeah, it's happened. It's kind of happened multiple times, probably depending on where you look, but like definitely happening, happened, definitely ongoing, whatever it's, yes. Hmm. And um, so we sort of say, look, they're both right. Uh, and the key, the key issue is that- Right, right. Right. Right, right. Mm -hmm. It's not just that, uh, that we're undergoing this transition to becoming super organisms. It's that fundamentally, the reason we are is we're transitioning from one inheritance system, genetics, to another, which is culture. And that's causing us to become superorganisms. So it's a, it's a combo move. It's, it's, a, it's a combo move. It's a double. Nice. Yeah. Left, left, A, B, A, B. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Cool, dude. Yeah. That is an awesome uh, little feather in the cap there that already probably has. Yeah. Feather in the cap. There you go. Yeah. 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 It's a bit of an ostentatious feather, but sure. Yeah. Go for it. Twitter is liking it. Yeah. It's a. It's a. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> uh, John, John and Heidi. Good John, the John and That's Heidi. awesome. Hey! Yeah! Hey! John and Heidi, hi! Hi, John and Heidi. Hi, hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> Tim and Katie. Oh my God, you look amazing. Don't they look good? Oh, thank you. They've you been guys in, look amazing. They've been oh, they, of party. course they always do. Yeah. We we here we prioritize our looks above all else. <laughs> I, I, all can, else. I can tell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's so good to see you both. How are it all is. the kids? Yeah. Oh, good, 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 good. good. Everything's good. Couldn't be better. We're so lucky. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Oh my God, that that's a delight to see those two in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> can, you, can you give a quick uh, rundown to what we're all celebrating? Haircuts oh. of this family. Yes. Mm. Yes, haircuts. In haircuts. the Montpelier family, we're, we're celebrating that. <laughs> That's an important the reason to have a Zoom confab. Yeah. Um, so I pandemic haircuts. Post pandemic, right? Well, no, not even. Still uh, oh. within the family haircuts. Oh, okay. Okay. All Sarah, all the time. <laughs> um, I have a um, upcoming new job which you need to keep in the cone of silence john and heidi oh, okay. you keep it it is it is yeah thank you cone of silence exactly yes. um there is there are two presidential appointed positions in the state of vermont and one of them is the united states department of agriculture rural development state director so I, I am, uh, have been nominated by Senator Leahy's office for that position. Ah, congratulations. It looks like I will probably be moving into that in September. Cool. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. That's cool. Will your office be in Montpelier still? 
The office is Montpelier, but there are actually five offices because it's a two-state yeah. job. It's Vermont yeah. and New Hampshire. Yeah. So there's one in St. J. Yeah. There's one in Montpelier. There's one in Brattleboro. And then there are two in New Hampshire. Wow. I think you should move to New Hampshire. Oh, thanks, T. <laughs> 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 yeah. I'm, thinking about, I'm thinking about biking to work. Barbell, Barbell's getting a new kitchen. So like, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's so professional. And so Tim, describe thy news. Yeah. Well, Liam, Liam had his second shot. Yeah, oh, yeah, Paul got his second shot. Liam got his second shot. Uh, and and my news is that I just published a, a paper in a fancy journal. So John and Heidi is very exciting. And the paper is about, get this, the future of human evolution. <laughs> ba -bom. Excellent. Wow. What, what's going to happen? It's gonna, happening now. Are we going to lose our <laughs> pinky toes or what? Oh, good for you. <laughs> yeah, we might. We might. It's not, it's not a morphological paper. So I don't know about changes like that. <laughs> But the idea is that we've got a way to figure out the idea. People are like, ah, we're a lot like ants. Are we going to become like ants? The answer is, yeah, <laughs> we're going to become like ants. But as I had to clarify uh, for the five-year-olds in the room, that doesn't mean small and hard. Right. Yeah. Doesn't mean someone's going to stomp on you. That's what I would do. <laughs> Cleans and drones. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. Well, congratulations. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. And it's exciting. Topher's birthday. And most importantly, oh, it's Topher's birthday. And, and we have Topher's to birthday. Oh, there we go. Maybe it's time to open some things. So I'll, oh. start, I'll start with this card. Let's and Heidi, Heidi and John, you should know dad's birthday is a very important number. It's actually a very, very special number. Mm -hmm. 72. Now, what do you get when you double 72? 44. And what do you call that? Gross. A gross. So that makes dad Dad's half gross. Half a gross. <laughs> or 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 only half gross, we can say. Yeah. Well, so I'm not totally I always thought he was if you're an half optimist half. or a pessimist. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so oh my god. I, <laughs> so, so here's their here's their card. <laughs> and inside it says you'll know soon enough <laughs> oh, God. true story or maybe you won't tell. just be ignorant of all it'll, it'll be perfect there are a couple of the cards there well thanks that's guys. excellent you're welcome <laughs> John and Heidi, if I could have, I don't know, a little bit of money for every time that mom and dad tell me about how, how much of a good time they have hanging out with you too, oh, that's great. then maybe I could give up my academic job. Well, that's very nice of you. Yes, we have, we have a blast with them too. <laughs> <laughs> Right. So here's the second card. Oh, very nice. It's probably nice card. Yeah. <laughs> and it's from uh, Grandma, and it says, "Happy 72, Topher. I love these for so many reasons." But let's name for my determination, steadiness, integrity, kindness, thoughtfulness, spend time, and love for our kids and their kids, and for all that we share and have shared for 45 years. Oh my God, wow. that's making me tear up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, is it, that's an important point. At 45 years, I hadn't thought about that. Do you know what that makes you guys together? Uh oh. Oh, no. Half gross and half gross. Gross. Well, well, what's what's a 90 degree angle called? Right. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. So there, therefore, you guys together are half right. <laughs> <laughs> that's brilliant, T. <laughs> that's, that's up to. They're half gross and half right. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. if, if you want more of this kind of insight, read my paper. 
No. <laughs> <laughs> um, speaking of which, I think our oh, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, that one's cool. Look at that one, Orion. Is that a brachiosaur with some clouds? What is that? It's an elephant shooting out clouds. It's an elephant shooting out clouds. Oh wow! And it says, "Have a day bursting with joy, Larry and Sharon." Oh, nice. 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 Now I think we need to at least open the big one. So for the oh, yeah. yeah. I was going to ask if there are presents involved. So yeah. there, there's some presents in the cake here. here. And oh. uh, I have a pair of scissors. So I'm going to go for the biggest one first. Go for the uh, biggest one. Do the big one, then we'll light the candles so that little people can get to see. Mm -hmm. so, can you guys see me from here? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Only if only if the the Elys aren't loud, because then it automatically switches to them, and I'm on the phone because our internet isn't working otherwise. Hang on. Oh, hang on. Oh, you're gonna mute. Yeah. So this is a pretty big box. Yeah, what do you think's in there, Toe? <laughs> well, any guesses? Uh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So there's the wrapping. Wow. Nice. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's got a picture on it. I'm not sure that's, that not, that's actually what's inside. No, that's be, not representative, I'm sure. Yeah, it could be their are recycling detail. the box. Yeah, yeah they, exactly. They filled it full of jars and nails or something. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's a good idea. I have some jars of nails I could get rid of. <laughs> Man, what a that's a man present. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Heidi, did you just say that is a man present? Because I love I love you. I love you. <laughs> Me too. I think he's doing some origami now. Dave's got to open it. All right. Oh, the battery. All right. There's the battery. Very nice. 56 volt battery. Grab a for no dropping this one in the stream. Oh, is that what happened? Charger. Oh, years, decades ago. Oh, decades ago. Papa, mama. And a cardboard protector. Yay. Awesome. Well, that's it. That's where, it. Where do you wear that? <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Oh, look at that. Wow. wow. What a beaut. Nice. I tell you. you Bravo. Just to open people. Hey, and a electric oh, see, look at him. <laughs> look at him. Look at him. <laughs> Boy, that is that is a beauty there. Now, just you know, you have to take off that plastic thing when you. Use it. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But still significant. Yeah. No, no, no. That's no, no. We're gonna save the rest. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Well, that's beautiful. Happy birthday, Dad. So this is a present from, uh, you know, all three of us, including mom and, and or all, all three of our households. And, uh, you know, we figured it was time for you to start, um, you know, Cut uh, down some trees, get well, no, getting a little less <laughs> serious with your, uh, you know, uh, with with your destructive tools. So we thought you get a nice new one, which kind of, you know, is actually better but also kind of maybe a little bit more easy to manage. You don't have to goose the trigger all the time. You don't have to goose it to keep it going. You press the trigger and when you press the trigger, it goes. And when you pull up on the trigger, it stops. And then you just go until it runs out of battery and then you charge it. It's just like anything else, except it's not a crazy, ridiculous two stroke motor. So yeah. Very yep. nice. Yeah. So if you're lucky enough to have a to have a um, a similar 
lawnmower with two batteries, you might have one ready to go when you when one of these runs out. There you go. And I will just add that once Paul comes back from the game of logging certificate course, then Whoa. he nice. can give you all the tips that you need for, you know, because, you know, you've never really taken any classes in chainsawing. <laughs> Putting it out there. Fair, fair enough. <laughs> that sounds pretty good. Oh, oh. Don't ever drop this in the stream. That's right. This is it. Oh, I'll try not the last to. one. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Now, Orion maybe had one other thing to maybe a story or something to share. Did they want to share a story with everybody? No. You're all set. Okay. We, we were just checking. Yeah. He was feeling a little. Yeah. Aurora, did you want to say anything to everybody? Oh, sure. Ready for that. Oh, what do you have? Little people, probably. She's got some noodles. Noodles. Oh, what do you do with noodles? Ah, uh, <laughs> this is what we do. <laughs> we eat them. We eat noodles. <laughs> we pinch Papa's ear hair. <laughs> totally. Totally. Very nice. Thank you, Aurora. Oh, goodness. Uh, so, well, Dad, do you have another present there? I've got, there's one in particular that I'm keen on seeing you open. Let me see. It's a uh, smallish. Yeah. Uh, I think it's the yellow one. That one. Yeah. Can I get you anything? Yeah, sure. No, if I hear no. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what do you think it is? Oh, <laughs> it, it's it feels like a pair of underpants. Nope, it's a book. Oh, it's a book. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, Dad. It's not a book. Pick up the underpants again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think the book came. If there, if there was a book, I didn't know. It. I Book is a metaphor. You need to read your underpants like a book. <laughs> thanks, thanks. <laughs> only, only really old men do that. <laughs> like you saw the way they wear their pants. Yeah, that's, right. <laughs> that's right. This says it's a Patagonia something. Mm. This may not be the precise one I'm thinking about. We'll see. It doesn't have an easy way in, so I guess I have to cut the plastic bag. I thought you were going to say I have to get my chainsaw. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Heidi. That's what I was waiting for. Yes. You have an easy way in. <laughs> so I use the chainsaw. That's what it's for. Solving problems. Yeah, that's right. Oh, uh, there. Ooh. Okay, this is uh, this is a, a, a Grandma Marie, I think. Uh, yeah. Is that right, Mom? Yeah. Okay, good, good. Very nice. Now I still want to see the other one that might be underwear. Uh, 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 under, the, under the outdoor jacket hoodie. If you want it that way. But yeah. hold it. It's the fabric is so nice. It's, oh, yeah. oh, it's a hoodie? That's really nice to have a little hoodie. Yeah. It's so it feels cute. very much like thine. Yep. Very nice. Yeah. The inspiration. Well, you know, uh, like for so many. <laughs> <laughs> so does he have an idea of which other one he's after? Mom is the one who should know which one it is. Mom, is there another soft thing there? Yes, there is. Oh, man. Yeah. Our second yeah. prison is coming tomorrow. I feel Feels very like sad. underwear. It's all wrapped yeah. right now. Yeah, it's uh, this is our all right. second prison is coming tomorrow with no wrapping, Dad. Just PS, and it's um, comestibles. Ooh. Well, I mean, is this what he's after? Per oh, I can't see that from here, but maybe <laughs> it's a little big to be a pair of underpants. Okay, that sounds good. Let's continue in that direction. 
Yeah, I'm gonna drip in this area. Wow. Ooh. Well, this is even silkier. Well, that's that's excellent. That's not the one that I gave you either. <laughs> you send it, Tim. Oh yeah. Dad, yeah, I, but I maybe, totally brought you that one. Maybe mine, maybe mine hasn't come yet. I, I guess I, I thought it. Case. I thought it had. Uh, so guys. maybe we have another one on the way. Well, let's not yeah. worry about it. There's, yeah, I got. It. Pretty sure. Was yours a navy one T? Uh, it's a, it's a, it's a shirt that does not long sleeve. Okay. Ryan, right. thank you. <laughs> so those were those were anti bug shirts, and the yeah, are they treated with the permethrin or something. Yeah, awesome. Sure. Sun and so I'm sure John one of our friends used to category otherwise gifts. We're gonna keep going by my blue water bottle. Oh. Blue water bottle. Oh. It would be uh, oh. Papa's red water bottle. Red. Red. Oh, red. Thank you. Tour, a tour, yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you take all his presents beforehand. There you go, one of each. Yeah, you gotta guess. I mean, what do you think that is? There you go, yeah, yeah, yeah. That Bring him over. Yeah, that, that yeah. one's the under there, so perfect. Yeah. <laughs> <You're already. laughs> uh, things you will never bother to go get yourself. Look at uh, this. Yeah, hey. what is it? That's underwear. Hey. Six pack of underwear. Hey, <laughs> ready, ready. Yeah. nice. So Ryan has one for you. You ready, Dad? Here you uh, go. Yeah. Hold it up, bud. Just, uh, just one, just one, just one, just one. Hold it right up there to that camera. Hey, hot sauce. Oh, 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 oh. Hot sauce. Hot sauce. Right. And it's the jalapeno kind. All right, okay. that sounds good. Excellent. Yum, that sounds delicious. The jalapeno kind is a good kind. <laughs> also, Tim, you could always pin the other group and then you don't have to see us when we talk. But I'm on the phone. Have you ever pinned anybody on a phone? Yes. It's all right. It's all right. It's cool. If I know how to do something you don't know how to do, I'm perfectly happy with that. Hey, more underwear! More underwear. Only, <laughs> only this time they're not tidy whities they're tidy blues. <laughs> tidy blues! Oh no, they're blue, red, blue, gray, blue, black, blue, red. Blue. Very nice. Yeah, look. One, two, three, four, five, six different colors. Oh my goodness. All right, we're going to hold up our next present for you, Dad. Oh. Oh, oh nice. I didn't know you were a sardine fan. Oh, and here's the gift that's coming for both of you. Where are you? Uh oh. Yay. Uh -oh. So a little, there'll be a little care package tomorrow that comes with the, with the grandchildren. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. So, uh, now, and, and when, when that arrives, you get to consider which is a bigger gift. Yes. Sending care package with grandchildren, or in my case, not sending a, a present or grandchildren. <laughs> I don't know. So, so Orion. 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 Yes. I'm gonna try to blow out all the candles. Will they help me? Oh yeah, ready. Ready? Should we sing happy birthday? Yeah, we should sing. Oh, we gotta sing happy birthday. Yeah. Ready? We gotta sing. Here we go. Pito. Come. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> All right, Grandpa Joe, throw out those candles. Okay, Ryan, ready? Is it going to help me out, Ryan? Be, do you want to help him blow out the candle? Right. Yeah, sure. There it is. See it? Yeah, see it. 
Awesome job. Well done. Yes. Thanks, everybody. Yay. All right, we love you guys. Hey, we love you. you. Have a wonderful good. evening. Enjoy that cake. I hope it's delicious. Uh, look out for more underwear. I'm sure some are on the way. And, you know, uh, fermented fish and some hot sauce tomorrow coming your way. And chocolate. And chocolate. And chocolate. And chocolate. And chocolate. <laughs> All right, love everybody. Love, 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 love. love you, Dad. Love you guys. Bye. Bye. Happy Bye. birthday, Dad. Good job, Heidi. Bye. Bye-bye, Roar. Bye, Roar. Bye-bye.